It's 56 degrees in Ann Arbor. Temperatures are on the uh, mild side for now. Not a drop of rain in sight for Detroit or the rest of southeast Michigan right now. There is some shower activity, as you can see out here toward Wisconsin, parts of Illinois. Don't need to worry about that. The chance of thunderstorms that comes for Sunday comes from this. This group of thunderstorms here associated with a cold front that's building in the plains. It will make its arrival here as we get into early Sunday morning, and it still gets closer to us by Sunday afternoon. So look at how this pans out. You can see the showers immediately to our west back towards Chicago. They try to make it in here, but they can't. The air is simply too dry. So we're looking at partly to mostly sunny skies for tomorrow. By 4 p.m., a little cloudier, but it still gets milder with highs around 60 or more. As clouds build and that frontal system gets closer while we're sleeping or just as we're waking up on Sunday, especially around 3 to 5 o'clock in the morning, showers and thunderstorms start to arrive. That is round one. Round two, isolated showers and storms. You can see the areas of red here. Some of those storms may be heavy. Anytime there's lightning, it's always dangerous, but I got you covered all weekend long. But that again is possible for Sunday afternoon before the weather settles down. And look at high temperatures for tomorrow, a little higher than today. We're looking at highs tomorrow on the seasonable side, mostly between 60 and 65 degrees. While tonight, temperatures fall down to around 39. Few clouds overhead. We're looking at sunset this evening at 831. On your Saturday, as we plan it out, it is looking good for different uh, activities, whether it's Little League games, strolls along the river, having a barbecue, things are looking good. 61 degrees for a high by 4 p.m. Now on your Sunday, different story. Showers and thunderstorms first early in the morning, then isolated ones during the afternoon. It still gets warmer, 40s in the morning, 70 in the afternoon. Then on Monday, we get a break once again, a high around 65 degrees, back to near 70, but with another good chance of wet weather on Tuesday before it dries out again, remaining seasonably mild for Cinco de Mayo.